Hello, welcome back to Comrade Stevenson's Paranormal PI. We've been called back to the church, there's been some very interesting developments. Multiple ghost sightings on one property. This is going to get interesting, let's go find out what's going on. Okay, so last time we were here, we did the investigation in the church, of course. And we discovered a figure which appeared to be like a monk. I, I believe they thought the ceremony, the church ceremony, was still ongoing. They, I, they seemed to be telling me to shush, be quiet. They were overseeing the church from upstairs, walking all around, etc. They were by the altar quite a lot as well. So let's go see if they are still residing here. And then we'll go see if there's any other developments as well. Getting some paranormal readings on the thermometer here. Right down the middle. And we've lost them like that. So you might notice there's a new progress bar as well. Will help especially if you're new to investigations to determine if readings are paranormal or if they're normal. So let, let's have a look at this one. Very good addition. Something I probably will play with off going forward though. Nothing paranormal about these temperature readings. Just for immersion reasons. Let's try and get that paranormal reading again that we were getting. Look! Who was that? Who was that? Who was that? That was someone different. Am I going insane or did they have like a powdered wig on? So we've seen a new ghost already. We'll have to work out what kind of ghosts they are as well. They didn't really pay attention to me, but I was quite far away, so maybe hinting at a residual right now. We'll see how that develops. In fact, if it is a residual, they will probably walk along the same path. Let's see if our initial resident is still here as well, though. I will hang around here, see if we get anything. I'll keep that as audio evidence. Do you know what they said? I That was a little faint for me. I have to listen back to the audio later. I believe that was a similar voice to the initial residents we had here in the previous investigation. But yeah, I got a vibe from them like they were trying to get me to be quiet. They didn't seem malicious. I just... I believe they were like a monk here, like, a, like I touched on earlier, perhaps uh, they're doing a church ceremony or something and they think it's still in session maybe. That's the vibe I got from the initial investigation. Again, getting more whispering. That was a very unusual noise. I will keep that as evidence. So they're still here alright, but I'm not really sure what they're trying to convey to me at the moment. I would like to see them again. I believe they were cladded in what looked like um, dark robes from head to toe. With a hood and everything. Getting some readings here. I'm losing them though. Here. Very tricky to follow. Hmm, these two readings are unusual. Very low. Sub 10 Something's now. What's going on here? These temperature readings are definitely paranormal. Yeah, we've hit below 10 C. Um, interesting that they seem to be settling around here. Perhaps they were sitting down even. Maybe they were observing what whatever they think is still going on here. Interesting that I was actually getting this reading here, near the book, Hymns for Church. I wonder if we'll start hearing some singing or chanting. I wonder if they really think they're at a church session and it's 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 ongoing 
We'll try and get some EMF readings, something that I did struggle with last time. Um, just really after a sighting here though. We'll see if we can build up to a sighting. And then I do want to investigate that potential other figure that we saw near the altar. Looked like they were walking from left to right here. Potentially they... What's out here? Let's have a look. What is out here? Oh, it's outside. Okay, so um, looks like whatever it was maybe came from out here then. Oh look, we have a basement here as well. Is this open? It's locked. That's probably a good thing to be honest. Nothing good happens down in basements. Let's head back in for now though, because I do want to try and get eyes on our initial resident. Who I believe is still here from what we've been hearing and seeing on the equipment. We're getting some very paranormal readings again. Here we go, here we go. Moving along with it now. Tracking their movement. These lights are acting funny. I should continue investigating. Look where they're walking, right to the altar. Oh, and there we go, it fizzles away. I was on the verge of getting that one. Wow, that's great audio evidence. Okay, here's the whispering again. That's extraordinary audio evidence. Once again, more whispering. Perhaps they're as curious about me as I am about them. It goes both ways. Easy to forget. So I've been here for quite a long time now. I've had no other developments. No sightings, no more whispers, no more paranormal readings. We know they're here though. We have detected their presence on multiple devices. We have heard things. So uh, now I'm very curious about this potential second ghost that I may or may not have seen here. <gasps> How long were you watching me? How long were you watching me? Oh my goodness. Well, thank- Well, thank you very much for making your presence known. Perhaps they were here the whole time wow, and I that's just- great audio evidence. Was not seeing them. Looks like they're very, uh, very cool with just watching me, you know? Just chilling. Maybe that, like I said, maybe they're just a bit cautious of me. A bit curious. Thank you anyway. So, they're still here. They tell me to be quiet. I better be quiet. Okay, let's get out of here. We don't want to pee them off a bit. They really, really, really want me to be quiet in there. <laughs> okay, you can have your peace in there. <laughs> let's go see if we can find potentially another entity. This is where it's going to get exciting. If we're having multiple sightings on one map, that's rather incredible. But I don't know what I'm looking for, or if I'm even in the right place, but it really did seem like something was walking through this door towards the altar, so... I mean, why don't we go check out the other buildings, I suppose? We'll see if any of these are now open. I'm just going to scan my surroundings very carefully, because I, I don't want to miss anything. That's locked. Let me check this building. On this side. We look a bit dodgy here, don't we? Just trying these locked doors at night. Looking a little dodge, Conrad. <laughs> oh well, it's honest work, I promise. It's honest, okay? Watch your step, mate. That's a ditch. That's dangerous. Watch where you're walking. You're gonna have an accident. I'm hearing, like, whispering still. <laughs> that told me off guard. <laughs> I'm guessing that's our first ghost. Okay, I'll be quiet. I know you're busy in there.
More whispers. Ooh, that is eerie audio evidence. Seems to be our initial ghost again. Just trying night vision out here at the moment, just seeing if I see anything. I've been here a long time. I have to say, I've seen nothing. I'm thinking what I could do for now, because I'm not seeing anything here. We could try a different area. And then maybe come back here later if need be, just near the end. Yeah, honestly, been here a long time. Um, I have not got anything. More whispers! Damn. You getting used to my presence? I might just give them a bit of space. I think I'm going to go explore the grounds a little bit. And just see if we get stuff in other areas. Because I'm not really getting much here anymore. Apart from our first one inside, of course. No sign of the second one again, though. What I might do, there's nearby here, there's a little graveyard. Let's go check this one out while we're here. There have been sightings and reportings of things here, too. We'll see if there's any truth to those claims. Feels very unnerving being here in pitch black darkness. It is so quiet, apart from the uh, wildlife around me. I think if anything happens, we will definitely hear it. I try calling out. If anyone is here, can you give me a sign? Could you let me know that you're here? Wow, I, I took a photo of a ghost. What? That's extraordinary audio evidence. On Earth? Oh my god. So they said, you're not supposed to be here, quite clearly. I mean, I don't want to intrude. If that is their wish, I, I don't want to aggravate them, so... We've witnessed something here. I've got goosebumps again. I've got goosebumps. But yeah, obviously we've just witnessed something, so maybe we should leave them. I do not want to aggravate them, you know, respect them. Damn, was not expecting that though. So again, another figure robed. Very similar appearance to the one inside. Obviously, both very important figures here in the past. Very close connections with the church. Maybe they both had a similar role. I am very curious about this potential residual ghost over here, though. I wonder if we can get anything if we just hang around here again. <gasps> no way. Something caught my attention out the corner of my eye. They were in the damn window staring at me. I feel like they're judging my presence here now. I feel like they're not aggressive, but they don't really want me here. I'm disturbing them, you know? So, I've been here for quite a long time now. I've still had nothing outside. I'm thinking, very briefly, of dipping my head back inside. Perhaps I was wrong about where they came from. Maybe they always were inside and I just misjudged, but it did seem like they were coming from the doorway. So, I'm going to go back in for a little bit, but I don't want to stay too long because I don't want to aggravate the other residents here. I think I'm going to go night vision for this one. It really does... They're whispering at me again already. But yeah, night vision really enhances my visibility here, as you can see. So just to recap what I think happened before, I think they came from here, and they disappeared around the bell. Oh? That's extraordinary audio evidence. Okay. Maybe I should take a seat and see how this pans out. Front row seat? Are you down? So I've been sat on the front row for a good few minutes now. And funnily enough, 
It's gone very quiet. No more whispering. I've not seen any movement. The candles are still lit. The door was closed, like they wanted me to stay in. But yeah, absolutely nothing. I will persist though. We will stay here for a bit longer. I'm actually hearing creaking right now. To my left. The creaking of the floorboards. Getting a bit close around here now. What do I hear outside? I hear something. Hello, is anyone here? What? I'll keep that as audio evidence. They were calling out. That sounded like a speech. Were they up here? It sounded quite far away, so I thought they were outside. Oh my goodness. It sounded like a speech, didn't it? I wonder if it's... I wonder if this is the main preacher or something. They looked important, remember? If I'm right about the powdered wig. They are obviously a symbol of importance. They were, they were a great important person here. Damn, they were inside, I believe. Misjudged where those footsteps were coming from. Anyway, front row seat seems to be working very well. I'm going to sit down and shut up and see what happens. And there I am being watched again. By our first residence. My soul just left my body. I am quiet. Well, I was quiet. I'll play along. I will play your game. Hello? Incredible, a photo of an entity? They almost seemed receptive to me then, didn't they? Shadows can be very receptive to your presence though. They heard the flash and they'd spun around for that photo. If you say so. Did they just say don't do anything? I think they believe I'm attending a church session. Looks like they're making sure it's running smoothly. Everyone's adhering to the rules. And potentially we have a preacher here. I really want to see him again. Sounded like he was rolling off a speech before. Still getting the whispers, been here a long time. I might just get up and have a little explore though. I wonder if they're going to tell me off and tell me to sit down again. Sit down and shut up. Yeah, they are. <laughs> they're off already. They're quite harmless, really. Oh, look, the candle is going out now. I've kept them burning a long time. So I'm currently in the centre of the church. I've been here for a long time since. The whispers have subsided a little bit. Activity has been generally quite low. No more from the potential preacher. I think we're probably at a point where we could call this in. Maybe review the footage. And try and see his appearance a bit better. 
But thank you very much to everyone that is here for everything you've given me this evening. I will love you and leave you. I will call this one in. It has been a pleasure. What an incredible place as well. Incredible location. So much potential here as well. Having multiple ghosts on one premises to, ex to investigate, explore. It's crazy. So much potential, isn't there? Very exciting for the future of CSPPI. Let's call this in, anyway. We have a lot to review. So we got very substantial evidence in most categories, just lacking slightly with the EMF. Could not replicate that one much, to be honest. It's a very similar trend last time I was here as well. That was actually a very long investigation. I was there for over an hour. I have trimmed down this investigation for you though. And yes, as seen from the footage, you can make out a powdered wig. So I do believe that was the main preacher. Due to his little speech he did before, I wish we could have got more with him, but he did seem a little bit on the shy end, which is fine. Maybe they were a bit cautious of me, didn't want to approach, etc. Although I did believe they were a residual, so maybe we need to go back and do a further investigation in the future. But we got more from the initial one in the church anyway. Do believe they were very important there as well. Not like they were just trying to keep the peace in the ceremony, really. They were overseeing things. They were watching me from the corners, from up above on the balcony, etc. Had the one in the graveyard, very similar appearance as well. And they weren't too keen on me being there, so I respected their wish and left, of course. Don't want to aggravate them. But it's very interesting to see that we're now getting multiple entities in one location. Very excited to see how this could progress in the future. I hope you enjoyed this investigation. Thank you for watching. I will catch you in the next one.